guys, it's Lee, and today I'm back with another Dollar Tree haul for you. First, I'm going to show you all the items I did buy, and then I will have some pictures at the end of some items that I thought were really cool or interesting, but I just didn't need them. Also, if you're new here, go ahead and hit that subscribe button down there and the little bell. It's totally free, and you'll get notified every time I upload new videos. Okay, so let me get into the goodies I found. First up, I found these sweet potato chips with a touch of salt by Ball Rex. That's what I'm gonna say. I don't know how to pronounce it. It is from Tiffin, Ohio. And it, there aren't a lot in this bag. It's only four ounces, but that's not really bad for a dollar. I love sweet potato chips. And so does my son. So I picked up three bags of those. Next, I grabbed four more bags of the Skinny Pop, and this is the plain popcorn. I think this is my favorite. I bought it by accident once, and now this is, this is the one I like the most. So it's 39 calories per bag, and it is one ounce of popcorn. So I picked up four more of those. Next, I found this reusable bag by Juncture that is, at first I thought it was camouflage, but now I think it is leopard print in green, black, white, and yellow. Let me know what you think that is down in the comments below. Next, I picked up some of these Martha White mixes. This is the blueberry muffin mix I got two three of those. You just add milk to them. I used to buy the Jiffy Mixes all the time when my kids were little. They loved them. These and the apple cinnamon. And I picked up the sweet yellow cornbread and muffin mix as well. Two of those. My husband opened the last jar of barbecue sauce or jar bottle of barbecue sauce the other day. So I picked up this Bullseye Original, and you get 17 and a half ounces. And then I picked up two of the, well, it's Bullseye Every Day. It's called Bullseye Every Day Honey Barbecue. Also 17 and a half ounces. I grabbed two of those. He really likes making barbecue chicken pizza. Next, I found this suave rosemary and mint deodorant and it is formulated without aluminum. This is a deodorant, not an antiperspirant, just so you know, and it says it is cruelty free. I grabbed two of them just to try out. So next I grabbed a few new toothbrushes. I've said before I like to change my toothbrush pretty often, probably more than is recommended, honestly. So I found these AIM, it's a two pack AIM soft Massage Pro toothbrushes. They came in a few different color combinations, but I just picked up the red and green. And then I found these AIM Triple Clean toothbrushes. That was hard to say for some reason. With Big Tuft technology. Don't really know what that means. Um, and it has a super grip performance handle. I just grabbed two of them, one in pink, which is my favorite. And then I grabbed a blue one as well. So yeah, I almost always pick pink toothbrushes for me. I grabbed another little pair of these Crafter Square detailing scissors for my daughter. I picked up these Airwick essential oils. Um, what are they? That one's on the floor. But these go in the warmers. So I picked up two of the lavender and chamomile. One thing I noticed is that they say they're good for 12 days instead of 30 days like a lot of them. So yeah, they're not gonna last very long. So I picked up two of those. Two of the fresh linen. And two of the vanilla and pink papaya. So we'll give those a try. I'm not 100% sure I have one of the warmers. 
I might. I'll have to look and see. But those are usually pretty inexpensive. They might have even had them at Dollar Tree and I didn't even pay attention. So next I found these. Uh, they are by Premier, although it does say it's a Greenbrier product. These are Sticky Note and Ballpoint Pen sets. These were near the Mother's Day stuff. So I got this one with the roses, so pretty. Then I picked up this one with the vine. I like that one too. And this one with the pink flowers. So cute. Let's see. The notepad has 30 sheets in it. And the pen comes with it as well. Not too bad for a dollar, I guess. Also, not too far from the Mother's Day stuff, they had these Crafter Square decorative stickers, and this one says, Mom, you're the best. Now, I have never used these before, so I don't know how well they stick. Um, you know, if you can wash the product. Oh, hang on a second. One thing I didn't notice, okay, on the front, I thought it just had one sticker but when you turn it over it has wife boss mom you mean the world to me best mom ever and then probably the one that says mom you're the best and cool mom so even better so it has all those in there and then there's this one that has number one dad and it also has best dad you're my hero thanks dad and I love dad so cool. And then this one that says, world's greatest person. It says, you're the best. I'm guessing that one up there says best friend ever. Eat, drink, burp, repeat. All right, that's gross. I'm just kidding. The world needs people like you and world's greatest person. So these are really cool. I was thinking when I grabbed them that they just had the one sticker. Might help if you could see them. Let me back you up there. So I only picked up one of each of those. So then for the 4th of July, I got this patriotic banner and it's an eight flag banner and it is 12 feet and I picked up two of them and I'm pretty sure I'm gonna give these to my friend for her, she has an above ground pool and she can put these along her pool deck and I think that would be really cool. So I got those and then I picked up two of these three packs uh, it says three pack patriotic mini flag. I always like to put these in the flower pots out front for Memorial Day and Fourth of July. I almost said St. Patrick's Day. Next, I grabbed some white acrylic paint. I just needed a tiny bit of white paint to cover up some screw heads on something. Doesn't really matter. So I just grabbed this one. I actually probably already had some now that I think about it but now I don't have to look for it. As many of you know, my daughter will be home soon in just over two weeks, and she loves Swedish fish. I don't know if she can get these in Ireland. I didn't ask her, but I know she loves them, so I picked some up. I have a little snack box going. We have finished her room in the sense of putting in the flooring, painting, um, and moving most of the furniture back in. I still need to get her desk and dresser well, it's one of those four QB things put back in there. But other than that, it's done. So I have a little box of snacks for her. Um, just stuff that I think she might have missed while she was gone. Yes, I'm that mom. <laughs> so the next I found these. They are by the Dixon Ticonderoga Company. Um, they are notepads. They're white unrolled notepads. There's 150 sheets in it. It kind of got smushed up in the um, basket it was in, but it's fine. And I thought actually my husband could use this for work. It's just a notepad. Thought it would come in handy for him. I picked up one of these foot files. They had two different designs. Uh, I just picked this one, the pink one. I think the other one was purple. Not 100% sure about that, honestly. But yeah, I just grabbed one of those. Next, I picked up these silicone ice mold, ice tray, what are they calling them? Ice cube trays. These work for chocolates as well. And they also work for 
jello jigglers or jello shots, you know, whatever. Whatever you want to make in them. So I got the flamingo, which I think I already have from years past, but I grabbed it just in case. And I got the shells because, oh, I guess I should show you. These are just little flamingos. And these are scalloped shells. Next, I found these baskets and I love them because of the nice long handles on them. I picked up two. They only had two different colors in the store I was in. They had gray and this peachy pink color. So yeah, I grabbed two of each and I used these baskets instead of gift bags. So if the stuff will fit in it, you know, I'll use this, put some tissue paper in it. And then the recipient also has a nice basket. These are also nice for going, you know, to like my friend has a pool so I could shove a towel and some sunblock in here and off I go so yeah I grabbed two of each of those colors I am running out of room on my counter next I found these little wooden boxes and I saw Theoni haul these and they're these little wooden boxes and you can put a label in them so I ended up getting two of each size so yeah, I thought these would be great. They say decorative box on the bottom for either my husband's desk or, I mean, I could use them on my desk. So I got this size. There go the Swedish fish. There's a medium size and a smaller size. So yeah, they just nest in together. And I picked up two of each of those. Now I have to decide where I'm gonna put all this stuff. And then the very last item I picked up in the store was this. It's a set of four stainless steel straws. You get two that are bent, two that are straight, and you also get a cleaning brush with it that I think is super cool. Uh, I saw Theoni haul these as well, and I was really, really hoping I could find them. If you're looking for these, they are in the store on Haynes Road, uh, across from the old Kmart. It's across from Goodwill now. They were against the wall with the cooking utensils. So I picked up three packs of these to give to friends because I think they're awesome for a dollar. And it does say that the straws are dishwasher safe in the utensil basket, but that the cleaning brush is not dishwasher safe. All right, so that's everything I found this time around at the Dollar Tree. Uh, to buy anyway and now I have some pictures of other items that were really cool but I just didn't need so check out those pictures and meet me right back here Welcome back. I hope you enjoyed those pictures and I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. If you're new to my channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button 
and the little bell so you don't miss out on any of my upcoming videos. You can also find me over on Instagram, Pinterest, and Facebook at Lee's Home 05. Thanks for watching. Bye.